Christmas edition of the Shallow Water Adventures with Keith and Jeffrey. I am Jeffrey. I'm Keith. Good job, Keith. And we're at Farmington Bay. We. Should I just keep, that? No, you can say that. We're in, we're at Farmington. We're out on the uh, the salty assassin right now. Um, we're actually out doing a little bit of a uh, little hunting. We've got our spread out to the uh, left of us here. If uh, you see us duck down all of a sudden and hear some gunshots. It's probably Justin. It's probably Justin, our guide today, who is uh, getting lucky. Um, I just realized I have the GoPro still on my head. You do. Is that weird looking? Should I maybe pull that off? I might pull that off. It looks That's nice. Good. That's kind of weird, right? I just realized that. Um, so today, everybody, we are live. Welcome to our Christmas edition today. Just like last time we were out on the boat, we're going to give away the farm. The farm. Yeah, we're going to give you ju just about everything we have. You know, it's like... It's, I feel like that's all I've done this uh, this whole December. It's nothing but giveaway. If you've been following us on Facebook or anything, you've, there's just like one giveaway after the next. It is literally nonstop with our with our uh, uh, our 12 days. days of Christmas going on right now, which I don't know if you've been following those, but there are some great pictures on there. Do you yes, see any I of those? Yes, I have been seeing some of the pictures. Oh but I also hear gunfire, so I'm a little antsy. You're a little but antsy because you, you're a little... My gun's still on the sleeve, but... <laughs> you are not just, prepared. Just oh, I'm dread. sorry. You have to do a show right now. I'm sorry. You don't get to shoot birds. You're uh, you're on a show right now. Um, but it is snowing, which is nice. Yes, a little bit So of snow. hopefully we'll get some birds in and, uh, and get some action here in just a little bit. Um, but today we are going to be asking you questions and giving away prizes for the correct answers. Now, Ambry, our producer, is not with us today. No. She's not in the boat. She is actually at home base watching right now. Ambry, please post on there. Say hey to everybody. Um, if you haven't already, I'm not, I'm not watching. Um, and, uh, you know, she's going to be judging the uh, question. She'll be on the actual computer and uh, announcing the winners. And, and the girls are going to do the best they can with the winner, so please don't get upset. We're just trying to make it fun, everybody have a good time, and some free stuff from some great sponsors. So. Yes. So let's keep it let's keep it light, keep it keep it nice and, and happy yes. everybody. It's and Christmas time. It's Christmas time. Merry Christmas. Is that your uh, Christmas your Christmas Sitka hat? Uh, yes, from two years ago. <laughs> you know, you kinda look like Santa right now with your beard. It's coming <laughs> very great, Keith. Coming in great. I just needed red hat. So I know, we needed but... your red hat and then you'd be the official Santa right there. We got a lot of guys checking in. Do we? Who do we have checking in? I don't know because I can't see. Do you want to switch glasses. switch me here for a second? <laughs> I'm like I can't see the. Oh name. my goodness! Oh, we do have a lot. Okay. Ooh, we've got Travis on. So, hey Travis, uh, over at BPS, if you have any questions about motors, um, duck calling, duck any, calling, especially. Yes, he especially. If you have any questions like that, Travis will be answering those questions because he's the man. Aftermarket parts, carburetors, props. Travis and the boys. A BPS will hook you up. Yes. Um, you should be here, Travis. We also have Alicia is watching oh, hello, right now. Alicia. Hey, Alicia. Alicia is the one judging the 12 days of Christmas. Oh, and yes. she can't be bought off. She already told me. Yeah, I know. She, I tried. She made that very clear to me as well, that there was no uh, no bribery going to happen with that. It's I'm, really snowing. I'm honestly worried about your phone right now. <laughs> it, it dies. Uh, Jackson Hill is on. Hey, Jackson. I got Joshua Petty on. John Shantz. Richard Rollo is on. Hey, Richard. Um, Joshua Petty. I said that already. Sorry. Luke Blanco. Damian Hooper. Trim up, Bo. Yeah. Um, okay, let's see. I got Brandon Webb is on. Tracy Gatlin. Hey, from South Carolina. How's the weather in South Carolina right now? Is it That's snowing? Nice. Is it snowing there? I don't know. I don't think it should be. I mean, it's, it's snowing here. It is really snowing here. Oh, we get home. Uh, Chad <laughs> Ream is on. Travis says BPS, repeats per hour. Oh, see, there's questions for... You know, Travis really should be on the show more with us. I, I honestly agree. think that. I, I think so, too. But he, you will see him a little bit later on in the year. We do have some fun stuff that Travis will at least be on one with us. Or more. Or more. But you know, he knows. He knows so much. I mean, he's much more fun to watch than you. Okay, so there is Ambry. She is on and ready to uh, judge. She's going to be our big judge and uh, and do all that. But before we get started with all of that, um, what's been happening this week? What's what's new? What's going on? Um, just recuperating from the big trip to uh, one of my favorite new places. Um, phone calls have been busy. Guys are running their mud buddies, having a good time. Sure. Um, Answering questions, what kind of props, what kind of fuel, what kind of spark plugs. Uh, so I get a feeling that some of our guys didn't do all their maintenance stuff ahead of time. Uh oh. So they're playing a little bit of catch up. But that's <laughs> playing okay. a little catch up. I get you. Some catch up is better than no catch up. 
Um, that's excellent. Um, so everybody's season is open. Hopefully yes. everybody has had uh, some success so far. I have. Um, you have. How about you? Um, yes. <laughs> Tons of success. <laughs> Just kidding. Shopping. I, uh, sh <laughs> yes, shopping and, uh, you know, actually working. Because some of us have, have work we actually yes. have to do. So, hey, I want to tell you a little story. All right, tell me a little story. I was sitting at home last Saturday. Uh-huh. And I was looking through the Sportsman's Flip li oh, newsletter, God. right? Oh. And a good friend of mine that I have pretty well was talking about buying a, a fishing uh, tent, whatever oh, you want to call it. Uh -huh. uh, and uh, so I thought, oh, cool. I'll send this to my buddy. And then about two hours later, I get this back, this little message back. I bought it. I blame <laughs> you. I'm like, but I sent you a really good deal, didn't I? Oh, hold oh. on. Uh-oh, we, got we some hear shots a gunshot. Going. We're looking around here. Justin, you just keep an eye on Yeah, your keep an eye. And... I probably had to pull mine out of the sleeve. Justin's going to like see one stand up and kick that phone right over. It's going to be Justin, really awesome. don't Everything... hit the phone, don't... baby. <laughs> if it goes dark for a second, we'll fix it really so, fast. So do you think this person that bought that really amazing, well-priced, really awesome ice tent, um, do, you think, do you think they're going to like it? I think so. I, I think it was a lot better than the do-it-yourselfer mode he was leaning towards. Well, I think I he's think gonna so. be pretty excited about it. I think so. I know, I know all of his friends are gonna be excited now. Well, I'm pretty sure that he was <laughs> promised by many of his friends that they would actually come <laughs> yes. ice fishing if he bought that tent. Yes. Yes, I'm actually really excited about it. Oh, that was me, he's talking about me, I bought it. I was having lunch and he was What's like, <laughs> oh, it's written on the back, right there. Um, I, yeah, he just caught me in that perfect moment. I already had my wallet out. I was doing some Christmas shopping and could not resist. <laughs> and I got blamed here's, for doing it. Here's a good the best favor. part about it is that I bought an ice tent and I have never <laughs> been ice fishing. Hey. Never have I been, but I am so excited to go that I bought it because it's my new, it's my new hobby. I'm it's pretty, your new hobby. I'm pretty excited about it. It's a beautiful tent and it was a great, great deal. So there it is. So we're going to be doing a lot of ice fishing here in the next few months once these lakes freeze over and whatnot. Um, anything, anything else? Everybody say something nice to Justin because he's running the camera today and our, our guide. So, uh, you know, everybody and our, be really nice. And our boat tower. And our boat tower. He towed he's the gonna... boat for us. <laughs> he did. The other one's being used because it's got a plow on it, so they're using it around yeah, the we shop. Yeah, we didn't uh, have the regular truck today. Move a little snow, so. Yeah, I gotcha. Justin was more than willing to come out with us. Well, it's a hard job. You I know, know, when you get out of the office that at that time, you know, like, I will volunteer. Absolutely. All right, should we uh, give some stuff away? Yeah, let's, let's, let's get Christmas away. started. It's like Christmas mud buddy. Okay. Here, you we'll take switch. that, and I'm going to take this. And I don't this. have to worry about who's winning, because Ambry's taking no, care of it. No, Ambry is going to take care of that. So, these questions, it goes to the first person to answer the question correctly. As seen by Ambry. As seen by Ambry. She will be the judge, right? So she's on a computer back at the office. What she sees very first, that is the winner. All righty. So we, uh, these questions all have things to do with our past Show. episodes. Yeah. Yes. So if you've been watching a lot, that's, uh, that's a good way. Another way, if you need a quick reference, you can always go on to YouTube right now because that's where they're all posted and you could rewatch them real fast. real fast that might be your best that's just my little hint all right let's get started first question this is the first question are we all ready is everybody ready are does it guys, look like they're you, ready are you ready Ambry? give us a sign all right not that one well it will <laughs> unfortunately it'd be like 10 minutes before yeah. that actually pops out so which is why we have her do it all righty man it is, i can't even read the screen this snow is is amazing all covering on it all righty Question number one. This is for a camo netting. This is from Camo Systems. This is one of our newer sponsors, Camo Systems. Um, and we really like them. I'm gonna come up and show you what this looks like. Henry so it's says a, they're ready. Oh good, they're ready. All right, so that is what it looks like. It's a little, so you're coming in a little is, slow, but. Yeah, is it a, so that's what that is. It's a camo netting, it's a, it's a great little cover up that you can set up easy setup for um for a for a hunt for a hunt yes really really awesome little it system kind of help the back end of it because they're kind of wide open we're a little exposed but we're good up in the front all right for the camo systems netting this is what the question is what state did keith and enrique visit last week where were they what state did they visit i know I know you know. You were there. Oh, that's right. It was. That was the whole that thing. That was a good trip. It was. It was yeah, you fun. had a good trip. It was a good trip. Yeah. Lots of good food. 
Yeah. You have mentioned that once or twice. Twice. I want to do it some more, too. All right. <laughs> Okay, good. So, that was the first oh. question. That is for the uh, camo systems netting. What, did something happen? That looks like uh, a couple of people have already answered. Yeah, but I'm they, not going to get involved in that because no, no. I don't want to be in trouble. No, we don't want to be in trouble. Sorry, All right, guys. That's all Ambry. Okay, next question. I'm going to have to switch it because I can't get around this question, panel. Okay. Switch me over there. All right. Question two. Question two. This is for a pair of native sunglasses. You can see those right there. These are my new favorite sunglasses. Uh, really, really great polarized. They're the, they're really awesome from Native. And we are big fans of Native. Thank you, Native, for uh, uh, for helping us out with these. They're Here, nice. great glasses. Come on, birds. Do we? Oh, I thought I thought I heard something. Do you hear something? Nope. Nope. <laughs> <laughs> sure didn't. All right, for the native sunglasses, what type, what type of shotgun was Keith using in the Thanksgiving giveaway episode? I know. <sighs> Why are all these questions about Keith? That's weird. I don't know. I don't know. You, he was using a specific type of gun. We're not looking for brand. No, not a brand. Not a brand, but a type. A type. A type of shotgun. Okay. That's close. Yeah, that's pretty close. Justin. <laughs> <laughs> nope. All right, next up. Do you think I'm going too fast? I don't know. Am I, if I'm going too fast, Ambry, let me know. Okay, here's the next one. No, Jeff, it's not a Benelli. It's not a Benelli. We don't, we don't care what brand it is. No, we're not looking for brand. We're looking for type. Type. Okay, next question. We have the Lucky Duck Tumbler. This is that uh, tumbler. This is the this is the one that uh, Keith has been uh, moaning about for the last little while, and I kind of gave him one. Although this is the bigger one, so the Lucky Duck Tumbler is what we have next up. And the question is: Are you sad you don't get to read any of these questions? Can no. you didn't bring your glasses? I didn't bring my glasses. Oh, you can't read. I know. All right, for the Lucky Duck Cup question, <sighs> another one about you. Name three snacks that came out of Keith's snack bag. I don't remember all those. You I don't remember, remember all those. I remember because I had to eat them. <laughs> the best part about that whole thing was is oh I would never eat anything that I made you eat. That's the problem. <laughs> that was so It was awful. funny, though, but I think that was just payback for no, it was another. A, I get it. I understand. I, I, I mean, payback's a... You know what. <laughs> uh, you know what. Exactly. So that was for the Lucky Duck Cup. Name three. You have got, you got to name at least three of them. There are more than three, but you got to name three, three. of them. All right. And one of them, Ambry really liked because after <laughs> yes. you got gagged on those little things, she, <laughs> she ate the entire package. The entire package was gone. I'm yes. like, are you kidding me? Um, I do want to apologize to everybody. We didn't bring them all because we knew it was going to be snowing. That's yes. why we didn't actually bring the physical things out here so that they were still nice and new when you got them. So we just put them on an iPad. Yes, so I just have pictures here. So next up, we've got the brown tangle free hat. These are the ones that are, what are they covered in? They're, um, Wax? Yeah, I think so. Yeah, these it's are the wax nice covered. Yes, one. the nice waterproof ball caps. Hit the switch. <laughs> I was like, what was that? All that right. was the grab bar trim switch. It's grab bar trim switch. Installed on the uh, yeah. Salty Assassin's 50 horse. It's just oh, yeah. running amazing. Oh, man. We just need to get some more hours on it, though. We're still in the break-in period. I know, so we're trying to be nice to it, trying our hardest. All right, here is the question for the Tangle Free Hat. What is, why is every question about you? I didn't write all the questions. I think I, I, know. I put on four. I I put most of these on too, and so did Amber. What is Keith's favorite place for barbecue? Oh. What is the name of the place that Keith went to that he is obsessed with? He only talked about it seven or eight thousand times. Um. So, what is Keith's favorite place for barbecue? That is your question for the Tangle Free Hat. All right. Don't tell him. I know you're you're hungry already. Well, I can yeah, tell. I know. Well, I know. some people are saying that the answers are up before the questions even asked, and I think that's just kind of a delay. Yeah, thing. that's a that's and a delay. In your... Unfortunately, guys, we can't control that. Uh, yeah, that's that's a yeah, that's a that's a networking the internet problem that I'm sorry. Hey, my I'm... good buddy Rob, and we're in this spot basically because kind of Rob kind of gave us some ideas of where to go, and he's a air traffic controller. Oh, and he's in D.C. but. Justin kind of helped us out too. Rob kind of got us where we wanted to go, and then uh, Justin said, "Hey, I've been in this spot. It's usually fairly good." So, so here if we, are. we don't Thanks, get, Rob. if we don't get anything, we it's, know who to blame. Right? There's two of them. Two of them. It's not us. Not us. 
Alrighty, next up, we have the Deep Apparel. This is the long sleeve gray uh, Deep Apparel shirt. This is a really, really fantastic like performance material. This is a really great uh, fishing shirt. Yes. Yeah, I have the really orange nice. one and I really enjoy you it. You do, you have the short sleeve orange. Yes, the short sleeve orange mm -hmm. and I really like Did, it. Did uh, something happen to that shirt? Yeah. You want to talk about it? No. Okay. I can't wear it anymore. Did you wash it and it shrank? My wife washed it in <laughs> cold water and didn't dry it. And I still can't wear it. And it's it. still, and, and it's, it's so maybe somebody's going to be able to enjoy the shirt that I love. Got it. I'm just not sure who yet. Yes, so be careful washing that. Yes. But I told you, like, you just need to give it a little stretch out. And it will, I, I will, it will, I will try to stretch back. it. It'll come back. If I put it on, it'll stretch. Because this material, I mean, again, that's that performance material. Yes. So it's really good. Okay. Uh, for the shirt, here is the question. What two items did Keith want from our sponsors, and did he get them? I don't even remember that. And what was the sponsor? There were two. Okay, so there were two items that, that Keith oh. had been like, oh, I want these so bad. Oh, I want them. I want them. And did he get them? That's the question. And no, that's not the two things we were literally just talking about. It's not. <laughs> yes, yes, it is. <laughs> I'm thinking, then what is it? Because that's the two things yeah. I wanted the most. Ooh. All right, here we go. Next up, this next question, we are giving away a meat hanger echo call. This is the meat hanger. And I'm not sure if this is, do you think that, is that actual the meat hanger? There was something wrong, that something happened with this picture. So I don't wanna, if that's not a meat hanger, but we are, it's the meat hanger that you're getting, whether or not that is this picture or not. But it's a meat hanger. XL. XL. That's I mean, XL. Not XL, Echo. Echo, whoa, what a, a dummy. A meat hanger echo call is what this one is. That's the next one. My buddy Rob said, don't, he said, hey, you guys look good, but don't blame me if you don't kill anything. <laughs> okay, for the echo call, we don't have a question. Why? We have a task. A task. You actually have to do something. So, the first person to tag all of our sponsors that we have talked about, that we've had with us for this whole season, in the comments, go in, say hey, and then tag with the at symbol. You put the at and then put in their name. The first person to tag all of our sponsors gets the meat hanger duck call. That's a nice call. It's a really nice call. That's a really great call. So uh, you want that one. So tag our sponsors, everybody. Go, 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 go. Tag the sponsors. And if you don't know how to tag somebody, um, you lose. You lose? <laughs> Just kidding. No, you really do. As you're typing in, type the at symbol and then begin to type and it will pop up options. Can so, I answer some of these questions while I'm out here? Yeah, if they're regular questions, yes. Yes, they're regular yes, questions. Yes, go ahead. You don't know the answers. I try. We'll go. I answer. Oh, no, I'm not. I'm out. Oh, I answered oh, them on this. You're answering Sorry. them on that. Oh, so okay. Josh that makes Hendricks asks, what is the desired angle of the transom for a mud buddy? 15 to 17 degrees works really good. Sorry, I, I replied. Yeah, I didn't yeah, think about no, like help everybody out here. Yeah. Like, well, we all want to know these things. Yes. 15 to 17 degrees. Yes. Got it. Okay, next up, we've got the uh, Sitka Gear XL Trucker Hat. This is a really, this is our new one. Um, Justin is wearing one right now. They're really, uh, they're really awesome. It's where, our, can they, where can they buy those? You can buy those too. Oh if they yeah, don't win you can it, right? absolutely buy one of these. Uh, if you go on to XL's website and go to their online store, online they store. sell them at the XL store. Sweet. Mm hmm. All right. Here is the question. Oh. Okay. What part? What motor part? I should say. What What part of the motor did Enrique show us how to weld? Oh. So we had that episode, a couple of episodes ago, he was out there welding something. What was he welding? That is your question. Do you have anybody else you need to respond to? Uh, Maybe take a phone call or two? No, no, I'm not doing phone calls. And Ricky is doing mm -hmm. the phone calls. Yeah, everybody, you should call Ricky right now. Yeah, I would tell you his <laughs> phone number, but I don't remember. So just call Alicia. Just call Alicia and ask for Ricky. And yeah, ask for Ricky. The number is 801 I hope everybody 352 does. Just 80, call Ricky 11. right now and be like, hey, how's it going? Yeah, just say hi to Ricky. Just say hi. Just say hi and be like, hey, I have to go. Hey, yeah. hey, Ricky. Everybody should do that. All righty. Next up. Oh, this is a 
This is a good one. We've got some Lucky Duck decoys. These are the these are the spinners. The spinners. Yes, these are spinners. See, look at these bad boys right here. That is. I hope I hope people can see these. You know, if not, too bad. Um, so Lucky Duck decoy spinners. Next up, here is your question. What type of bag did Keith's snacks come out of? So in that episode when we were tasting the snacks, what- Are you making faces because you see a bird go by? I saw it. Oh man, gonna pick up that gun and shoot right over our head. <laughs> Just keep it high and don't yeah, blow our ears high, out. right? Um, yes, there was- oh. Sorry guys. There was a bag. He was pulling them out of a bag. What what kind of bag was it? A waterproof one. It was. It that's was. your that's a good good hint. Yeah. Good hint. Can I give some more? No. Okay. Alright. Next up I've got a BPS. I think it's a shirt. It's a long sleeve BPS shirt. Like that right there. Alrighty. And the question for the shirt. It's another one about you. I can tell Dude, that you did not I, write these questions. I did not you're, write. It's really I because you're the only one doing anything that's fun. You guys just play on computers all day. I, I have know. to answer questions. I, I know. I don't actually do anything. Um, what did Keith get on Black Friday while shopping? Oh, it was a good item. <laughs> <laughs> what did Keith get on Black Friday? It's kind of a, that's a good one. That's a good question. I like that question. I like it too. I got something, but it wasn't on Black Friday. I also got, I got a whole bunch of stuff. Because of I, like, like, to, I like, like to go shopping. It was a justification. Uh -huh. My daughter needed a bigger shotgun. And then more of an adult size instead of the youth because she's getting bigger. So I justified it by uh -huh. saying it was for her. But sure, it was for me. That's not the answer we're looking for. I though. know. All right, next up, this. All right, if they can't see him if I stand up. All right, now it's time for the big one. The big one. Ooh, one of the big ones. Everybody wants one of these. This is the big dog right here. We have one. Oh my gosh, this thing is. I'm going to run out of batteries on this here in just a second. That's going to be awesome. <laughs> All right, so this is the big blade. We're giving away a big, a big blade prop. We have a big blade on our motor. We do, because we're smart. Yes. All right, for the big blade, here is your question. How many episodes of the Shallow Water Adventures have aired? Like, all, how many episodes have we done? I have no That's idea. all you gotta do. Just tell us how many episodes, it's a number. Between one and 20. Between one and 1,000. Um, all right, next up, we have got, Ambry, I'm gonna tell you, um, Ambry, I need you to, um, I hope you have this document and I need you to send it to like uh, Keith, like text it or email it to Keith or something because this is going to die and I'm not going to have these questions. Anymore. If you email it, do it to ride red Keith, all lowercase, at gmail. Don't do it to my mud buddy because I'm get not it. hooked on my mud buddy. It, you know. All right, next up we got a tangle free camo hat. This is a uh, Optifate. This is a tangle free Optifate hat. The question is this. The first person to tag five friends in the comments. Holy cow. You see, ooh, nice splash. Got one? a couple of them out there, yeah. Oh, man. We're on the wrong side of the bay. Yeah, we are. Well, we're also we're also not doing much calling yeah, or anything, so we're gonna we're gonna get them in just a second. Okay, we got First three. person to tag five friends in the comments below. Tag your friends, you get the hat. I don't have five friends. I know, you don't have five friends. All your friends are right here in this oh, boat right now. Oh, this is the one I want this to win. This is Keith's, this is Keith's. Okay, this is a Camp Chef. We're giving away a Camp Chef two burner. This thing is crazy. Now, not that bottom part of the picture, just the top. It's just a two burner stove right there, okay? This is from Camp Chef. We love Camp Chef so much. Keith would marry them if it were legal. But it's not, Keith. You can't marry Camp Chef. Nope, here, but I buy a lot of their stuff. <laughs> The next person to tag 10 friends gets that. Wow. Tag 10 friends in the comments below. Can I make up some friends? <laughs> <laughs> Keith well, does not count the, as your friend. Week next week we're gonna be cooking out we with are. one of those. You're absolutely we're right. Gonna we're gonna take one of those out and cook with it. And we'll show you some cool little quick recipes, how to use it safely on your boat. Yes. Sorry, we have to keep moving yes, on. We'll talk about on, it in a minute. Okay, on. all right, we got a Pete Dryer's, there's a boot dryer. Boot dryer. This is the one that Dave is obsessed with. Dave Reynolds. Yes, Dave, our 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 good, our 
boat guru Dave loves those. Go ahead, call him in. Do it. Do you need to call him in? False alarm. False alarm. Okay, for the uh, the peat dryer, the boot dryers, here is your question. First person <laughs> to post a picture doing, okay, I love oh. this one. The first person to post a picture in the comments below doing a thumbs up. Two thumbs up Push in the button. picture plus, plus you have to include the hashtag shallow water adventures. So you do that, just uh, start a new comment Take a picture of yourself doing the thumbs up and then type hashtag or the pound sign, shallow water adventures, all one word. First person to post that in the comments gets the boot dryer. Oh, that's, that's it. it. That was it. Now we can hunt. Oh man, okay. Whew. So we made it without dying, fantastic. I do want to thank all of our fantastic sponsors though, whom there's with, a lot of shooting going there on. There is a lot us. of shooting. I know. I gotta wrap this up so we can so we can get on. Um, Echo calls, Tango Free, XL, Lucky Duck, Deep, Camp Chef, Native Sunglasses, and BPS. These companies are so amazing. Please go on, check all of them out. Like them, friend them, share with them. They they do so much for us and for this industry. We really, really appreciate all they do. Well, and without them, we wouldn't be doing this show and giving away all this cool swag. Absolutely. And so, getting to wear some of it, too. And getting to wear some of yes. it, too. We really appreciate them. They're really, really awesome. Um, big shout out also to Glenn. Um, he, our CEO and owner, he is, um, he's amazing without him. Of course, none of us would, would be here at all. Um, so thank Glenn, thank you so much. Um, everybody Merry Christmas. Yes. We will be on next week, but, um, we'll, we'll be out hunting. So we won't be answering a lot of questions, but we want everybody to have a really safe, very Merry Christmas. Exactly. Merry yes. Christmas. We'll be next week. We'll be doing a little. Yes. We'll, we're just going to be out. We're going to be cooking and having a basically a little party um it's our time not your time so <laughs> just kidding and, and when, when i get back to the shop i had tonight and tomorrow if you have questions yes. email them in text them in and we'll take care of them ricky and i'll get some travis is always great helping out our friend jay paul jackson helps out too yep uh, if you've got dog training questions i've got two great dog trainers with uh jay paul Freddie Freddie King. King. So, yeah, those guys are great. Travis with the, with the uh, duck call, so that we've got a lot of resources here for you. So, thank you so much for watching. Tune in next week at 3 p.m. Mount Standard Time. We're going to be out here on the salty once again. As long as it's not frozen, we'll be here. It's not frozen. Merry Christmas, everybody. Thanks for watching. We'll see you next week. Merry Christmas. I'm going to have Justin now uh, hit that uh, done button. Bye, everybody.